celebrities are known for their willingness to take risks when it comes to attractive appearances. Whether they're in committed relationships or not, they don't hesitate to put it all on the line. And hey, many of us regular folks do it too, so why should celebrities be any different? The only contrast is that their actions are captured on camera. In this video, we'll present you with instances where celebrities openly flirt and take daring chances, be it during talk shows or interviews. Stay tuned, make sure to subscribe to this channel and enable post notifications. We have a plethora of incredible content waiting for you. Tiffany Haddish and Kevin Hart undeniably share remarkable on-screen chemistry. However, did you happen to be aware that they've been exploring that chemistry further, with Tiffany showcasing her twerking skills off-screen? How'd you get the lead? Dancing. Yeah. Wow. She twerks. You know what twerking is? Not, it wasn't from twerking, it was from doing a shim. Well, Molly Cyrus is twerking. A shim with a twerk. Well, Tiffany got a lot more back there than Miley Cyrus. <laughs> so, there's a, there's, a, there's a massive reason for it. Uh, you really realize how close you are um, with the person that you're doing it with because these things become so much fun. The days go by fast. <laughs> Tiffany, don't start. Tiffany. <laughs> No, Tiffany, no, Tiffany, don't start this mess on TV. You're the best big no. little brother. Don't do that. Don't. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Jed. I'm not entirely certain about this particular individual, so I'll leave it up to you. Was Russell Brand taking a daring gamble, or was he simply being too Russell? Liz, that's your fault. Because you took your eye off the road, because things was getting a bit fruity out there. All right, Liz, <laughs> we goodbye. Were. Yeah, thank you. Well, it's been really a wonderful thing. See you later. Russell. All right, take care. <laughs> Russell, how can I do your bra just like this? <laughs> Liz, I love Thanks, you. Liz. From their collaboration in A Star Is Born, Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga have avidly flirted, seizing every opportunity. He came over to my house and uh, we had a wonderful time together. I mean, as soon as he came in, we're both from the East Coast and we're both Italian Americans, so I was like. Uh, heating up or pasta from the night before and so I was playing it on the piano and he started to sing and I was like oh my gosh Bradley your voice I was blown away by him I mean he just he sings from his soul he sings from his gut I'm not quite certain who the brave risk taker in this scenario was was it Regina Hall or perhaps Kevin Hart that's for you to decide but what I can say with confidence is that a daring move was unquestionably made listen End of the day, this is what makes me. No, baby, baby, come. <laughs> End of the day, this is what makes me. No, no. <laughs> you got different types of men. You got soldiers and you got tanks. <laughs> I'm the one that's shooting the bullets. You understand know what I'm saying? Bang. So, so basically, you know, to get to what I got, you got to think about a squirrel. If he goes up a tree, what happens? You daggone right, Peter Pan is going to come. <laughs> this daring elderly woman went for broke. A smooch from none other than Kevin Durant? The legendary KD himself? You can bet that her friends will be gasping for breath. Lamar Odom comes in. Uh, she got hit with the ball and she gets a kiss from Kevin Durant. She's going to tell all her friends about this tomorrow. She needs a picture though. She, somebody's got to send her a picture of that. She wants it to be like baseball where you keep the ball. <laughs> Conan O'Brien certainly pushed the boundaries on this occasion, but Nicole Scherzinger was quick to keep him in check. The way that I met Simon was they asked me to be a guest judge. Focus, Conan, to be, um, <laughs> they asked me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm her serious talk. Finally, we'll be real speaking here for a of, second. Speaking of, speaking of. You I didn't think I was going to look down there? I think. Oh, I love Craig Ferguson possesses the charm to effortlessly sway any woman, but have you ever considered the sheer audacity when it's the women who take charge of the conversation? Uh, awkward pause, with or without mouth organ? With. Okay. Do you want to blow or shall I? No, maybe without because it'll be more awkward. Okay. I feel I've lost control of what's going on here. <laughs> 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 
Well, Justin Bieber and Ariana Grande truly went all in, taking a bold leap of faith with their exhilarating and flirtatious performance during Ariana's honeymoon tour. After spending a whopping nine hours in a steamy hot tub with Chris Hemsworth, Jessica Chastain might have felt a bit aged. However, let me assure you, she would throw caution to the wind just to relive that sensation. There's a scene with Chris Hemsworth and I in a hot spring, and we filmed it for like eight or nine hours in this hot tub. So, you know, around like hour four, I started to look like I was 120 years old. It was not sexy at all. Is spending nine hours in a hot tub with Chris Hemsworth all I imagined it would be? And more. <laughs> Russell Brand is a man who never hesitates to express his emotions. He's someone you can rely on to take bold risks without hesitation, no matter the time or place. However, it seems that Keanu Reeves might not have been aware of this intriguing aspect of Russell's personality. I love you, mate. I love you when you're Neo. I love you when you're out of Bill and Ted. I loved you on the coach ride one. I've nothing but love you, and I've had very little in return. Oh boy. Gal Gadot took a daring leap to ask Jimmy Fallon a question that caught everyone off guard. And as for Jimmy, let's just say there was only one correct response to be given. I've seen the movie. I know how seriously comic book nerds take this kind of stuff because I am one of them. Really? Yes. What do you think about my breast? Uh, what? No, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, tell you what. It sounds weird. It's I don't know. Not, Hold on, let me figure like... it out. Okay, so figure it out. <laughs> they no, look no, no. great. Yeah, both of them. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Our childhood celebrity crushes often leave us captivated. But ask yourself, are you willing to go to great lengths just to experience the presence of your crush? Sebastian Stan, without a doubt, was more than prepared when he indulged in flirtation with the alluring Sharon Stone. I've been, you know, I've been meaning to tell you this for a while, but I, I, probably about 15 years. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I, <laughs> I feel like I've seen you all my life. How would one ask? Sharon Stone on a date in Romania. Kind of like this, Chef Fudge. Would you bite me in the neck? Oh my God. <laughs> what you say? <laughs> okay, Stop. you are pretty cute. I just want to throw that out. He's actually gone red now. He was, he was all cocksure. He was all like, yeah. When Chris Evans and Elizabeth Olsen appeared on Ellen's dance show, it seemed like a simple affair of two celebrities enjoying themselves. However, their lively performance left their fans with plenty to ponder upon. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Camilla Cabello and Shawn Mendes had a blast attempting to convince the world that their connection lacked chemistry. Little did they realize that their efforts were inadvertently showcasing their incredible compatibility as a couple. You both might love each other. You don't know how to oh, commit. It sounds Am like I we right? Both made out and we're just There's totally no coming. way you haven't made out. You we totally have. Totally no. have. You really haven't. I, I don't promise. believe you well, though. I, I don't care. I'm telling you, every time I try to make a move, she's like, no. So you're you weird. have tried to make he, a move. You have right. never tried to make a move. The only thing that's more fun than watching you two both scrum is watching your team of publicists over there going, <laughs> oh my god. Simon Cowell never anticipated a flirtatious performance from Cary Graham, but let me assure you, that bold woman took a tremendous risk. <laughs> With his charismatic flirtations, Bruno Mars unleashed his charms upon Miranda Kerr, and it's hardly shocking that their hearts were on the verge of intertwining. It's good. You like that? Yeah, you and I, we're a good team. The dimples <laughs> and the wink, we got it going on. I can't do the wink though. Do it. You can See, do it without. You just do it so easily. Do it without the noise. 
When Jennifer Lawrence inquired about Chris Pratt's favorite aspect of her, he was well aware that he had to put it all on the line. Chris, this is really tough to ask. I'm kind of embarrassed. What's your favorite part about me? Oh. <laughs> if you had to choose, and be specific. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Thankfully, she's beautiful on the inside. Mm. You know, <laughs> I don't think that's what she was asking. No? During their interview with W Magazine, Margot Robbie and Michael B. Jordan took risks that far surpassed the simple act of naming each other as their favorite actors. Believe me, they delved into much riskier territory that left everyone on the edge of their seats. Who is your cinematic crush? Cinematic I was going to say Margot. I was good. This is, I mean, I, it's awkward because he's sitting right here. Yeah, it's kind, of, it's kind of weird. Like, Miss Robbie here. <laughs> no, he's back. He's good. Oh, mm. little, little fist bump. <laughs> and thus, we've reached the conclusion of this video, my friends. Which of these moments stood out as your personal highlights? Join the discussion and share your thoughts in the comments section below. Remember to show your support by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribing, and enabling post notifications for this channel. We've got thrilling content in store that you definitely don't want to miss out on.